hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is unknown me if you are coming to this channel for the very first time i love you i love you thank you so much so today i'm going to make a natural pink lip balm for small business this is natural and this will help moisturize your lips exfoliate your lips and make your lips soft and supple watch this video guys So guys, let's introduce all our ingredients. This is our petroleum jelly, guys. This is not Vaseline. This is not Blue Sea Vaseline. This is raw petroleum jelly. The one they used to make Vaseline. This is it. So I'm going to drop the benefit of it. And the next one is our cocoa butter. I'm going to be telling you uh, the measurement as we go. This cocoa butter is really, really nice. I love using cocoa butter instead of shea butter. Next, I'm introducing my containers. These are 10 ml containers I'm going to be using for this production. You can see how it is. They are very, very beautiful. So now I want to add in a petroleum jelly. I'm adding 160 grams of petroleum jelly, guys. I'm adding 150 grams, which is 53.50 percentage for those that are formulating. I'm making a 300 gram batch of this pink uh, lip balm, guys. Uh, remember I added pink lip, I made a video on pink lip cream. This is not the same thing. This is natural. This will just moisturize and exfoliate and maybe brighten your lips a little. So I'm adding 150 grams of my petroleum jelly. I'm adding this bit by bit so that I don't get to add too much of it in the foundation, guys. This, this uh, petroleum jelly is so, 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 so nice. I love it. I love it so much, guys. Now... We are done. We want to add uh, cocoa butter. I bought this from Isa Organics. You can patronize them. They are so nice. They're on Instagram and they deliver smoothly. This cocoa butter is very, very amazing. So I'm adding 50 grams of my cocoa butter, which is 16.7%. Uh, 16.67 rather percent for those that are formulating 50 grams of this is enough you can see how solid it is the next thing i'm adding is my lemon oil you know lemon will help brightening the lips so i'm adding lemon oil of about uh, 30 grams of lemon oil guys i love this oil so much it's really nice if you can buy this big bottle you can buy from any organic seller they are going to sell for you the next one is a carrot seed oil carrot seed oil is amazing for lips these oils they are so good good for lips you can use coconut oil if you have but i chose this particular oil i'm using 27 grams of my uh carrot seed oil I'm using 27 grams i'm just going to put them on the screen you can see how it is i'm going to double boil this i'm going to double boil these guys so we are going to add our next ingredient which is our powders you can use any lightning powder which is good for the leaves I don't have a beetroot powder, I've used it, but I'm using mulberry powder, which you know mulberry is amazing, it has amazing benefits. If you don't get this particular pink, pinkish mulberry, you can actually use the other one. There's one dark, the dark pink one, but I actually love this one. It suits into many colors, like it's finely um, preserved is okay that one too is good very good they do the same job but this one is light pink and that one is dark pink so i'm adding uh 10 grams of my mulberry powder to this formulation this will help to brighten your lips naturally not sharp sharp not seven days naturally guys and this is what this is what we want in our production 
So I think I put uh, too much of it. I'm reducing it. So next, I'm adding my glycerin. You know, we need glycerin. Glycerin will serve as an humectant to this. This is going to be nice. I'm adding 10 grams. And next is my propelling glycol. I'm adding just 2 grams of propelling glycol to this formulation. I don't want to add much because I need propelling glycol to actually dissolve this uh, mulberry. That's why I'm adding it in this formulation. You can see how creamy this is. So I'm going to actually double boil this. I'll double boil all our oil face ingredients. And, and next is our mulberry and the propelling glycol with a glycerin so i'm just i'm not going to double boil this small berry for too long just a little just to heat it up a little so i don't get to lose out all this ingredient so we can see now that it's all, has all melted and it's now liquidy you can see how beautiful this is so guys now we have to work at a very fast pace before this thing begin to turn solid so now i'm going to add my mulberry you can see how it is please make sure yours is creamy like this so that it's going to come out nice so we are going to add this into our formulation quickly before our butters and uh, petroleum jelly begin to solidify so i'm adding everything in this Foundation. I'm adding this. Sorry, guys. I don't want to steal anything. I don't want to leave out anything. I must use all, like all. <laughs> so now I'm done adding the more berry. Now I'm just going to. You know stir and move to the next ingredient the next cool down ingredient i'm going to add i'm going to add my cool down ingredient like now because i'm not going to wait for this to solidify but first of all i will have to blend this up with my hand stick blender if you don't have hand stick blender you could use your normal you know blender normal hand mixer to mix this but you have to try to blend together so now i'm adding in my lactic acid and vitamin e into this formulation lactic acid is five grams vitamin e is five grams guys into this formulation and added in into the uh big carrier i added the mulberry that's what i'm trying to bring up out everything so i'm going to stir this continuously so that everything can blend now i want to add my pink food coloring to this i actually love this particular one because this one will actually make it look fine and beautiful you know if you don't have this you can actually get the uh, beetroot powder to add but i don't have that so that's why i'm adding this particular one to it adding much because i really want it to be very very pinkish in color so that to be very attractive for customers to buy i'm selling these guys if you want to buy from me please patronize your girl but if you want to make this no problem so i'm mixing up everything you can see it's becoming pinkish and very 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 beautiful it's going to be very beautiful after it cools down so you have to mix this thing very fast because it's cooling down like right now and once it begin to cool down it will be difficult for you to pour into the container it has to be liquidy so that it could actually take the shape of the container so i'm mixing this up this is so beautiful this is so nice and now i'm going to just mix it up a little before i add the next or i will say the last ingredient i'm going to mix 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 till i'm sure everything has blended 
and it's starting to cool down that's how i tapped it like that you know so now i want to add the next or the last ingredient so i'm adding in my fragrance you can use strawberry you can use mango you can use any yummy fragrance for this so i'm using strawberry and mango for this uh formulation at uh three grams three grams of my fragrance so i'm using strawberry and mango guys so so yummy this this place is this aroma <laughs> this aroma in this my workspace is so so yummy right now so so yummy so now i'm just going to mix it up so that everything will blend quickly before i pour it into my container guys like i said before you need to be very fast if you are not fast this thing will cool down and you have to heat up again and i don't want to go through that stress to heat it up again but if yours eventually cools down before you start pouring just heat it up again and if it remains you keep it and heat it up again before you pour it into. you can see how beautiful this is so so pink you can sell this i make this to sell you know when i started skincare it was so difficult to get recipes that's why i'm showing you guys so that you can you know you can do well in your business now i'm pouring this you can see how beautiful wow this is amazing this is going to be very 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 pink and yummy to moisturize your lips exfoliate your lips but this is not going to make your lips whiten you know it's not going to make your lip white even if you're using a pink lip cream you definitely need a moisturizer because your lips need to be moisturized and remember i'm posting this recipe because very soon in two or three months time hamatan is coming though so you need to make some cool cash so don't forget me when you do do <laughs> so um, please subscribe subscribe like comment please like this video you know so that youtube can actually you know push this my video far this is not what you see every day on youtube guys so i'm pouring it pouring it pouring pouring oh i've made a mess of this thing you can see it's remaining so i'm just going to keep it when i want when i buy more containers i'll heat it up again and you know we are set allow this to cool down before you cover it it's starting to cool down already because i wasted so much time just because i want to do a video for you guys so now you can see it's looking so beautiful and pinkish you can't wait to apply this on your lips right <laughs> so do i so now you can see how it is you can sell this this is sellable because that video i made on pink lip cream people were asking me can i sell this can i sell this come and watch this one though so that you can sell this one and make some cool cash and let them know it's to moisturize they are not looking for seven days permanent pink lip no this is a moisturizer this will sell very well in hamatan i pray this video gets to a million views before then guys so now i'm covering them it's now cold very cold and they are okay so i'm covering them up you know covering them up if you've watched to this point and you've not subscribed uh uh wait seeing hey, support your girl be cool support your girl subscribe please like and comment you can you feel free to ask me any question and if you want me to do other videos for small business please feel free to ask in the comment section i will do my best to do so i'll do my best i'm here to help you guys i can't do trainings because i don't really have much time for that but i, I can actually put some good good stuff here for you to base cream no need to be buying creams i'm doing pre-mixing scrubs body scrub lip scrub different things on skincare for small business guys i'm rooting out for you <laughs> i love you 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 i know it's not easy but you're going to get there you know yeah we are done we are done thank you so much for watching